What kind of form is the filly in? Well, she's in great form. Uh, you know, we ran her pretty steady during the winter, and then I gave her a, about a six-week break before her last race, and she ran the best race of her life at Churchill in her last start, and um, we think that this race is a, a good next step. So what, what went into the mindset with, you know, shipping a cross country to run in a grade one? Well, I think as much as anything, it was timing. Um, you know, we were honored to be invited. I think it's a very important race. Anytime you can run for grade one with a filly, um, I think you've got a, if you've got one right and ready that you think can be competitive, you go for it. So, she, and she seems to be one of those fillies where, I mean, she's definitely on her way up. Yeah, she seems to be improving. Um, you know, she's kind of sniffed around it, uh, you know, the, the stakes race type of deal. Uh, you know, I think she was second or third in Florida in a couple of stakes, and then she was, uh, I believe, third at Churchill in another one. But, um, you know, she's a lovely filly. She seems to be getting bigger and stronger, and, you know, timing is everything. Hopefully, hopefully we got good timing. And the last three races you've gone on the turf, do you, the turf is kind of where you see her career continue? Well, she'll, she'll run on about anything. Um, she worked excellent at Churchill in her last work on the dirt in 59. I do think that she's pretty versatile as far as that goes. But uh, good horses run on any type of surface, and um, I, I believe that uh, the turf's as good as any for her right now. Now, you've won a lot of big races. What would a win in, in the American Oaks mean? Well, it'd mean a lot, especially being that we own part of this filly. Um, you know, anytime you get grade one status with a, with a filly, uh, you know, we've got our farm in Lexington, which I'm sure we'll probably consider retiring her there one day. But, um, you know, it'd be pretty special. I haven't won a, a grade one since I've been back, but we've kind of sniffed around at it, and I think we're due. What, uh, talk, talk about how uh, my baby baby got her name. Well, um, Originally, I bought this filly in, in Phasic October. She's the same sale that Big Brown came out of. But um, I bought her, and nobody seemed to want her for a long time. We owned her ourselves for almost six months. And so we went ahead and named her. Uh, my daughter is, she does not like being called a baby baby because she considers that a small child. And she's always said, I'm a big girl, Daddy. And I said, no, but you're my baby baby. And so anyway, we kind of settled on that name and she, uh, she's turning out special, it's really neat.